Located here in Porto Alegre, Brazil, at home to SC Internacional. And here we have Fiorentina against Barcelona. Well, I'm Peter Drury, and I'm joined in the commentary box by the familiar figure of Jim Beglin. Glad to be here, Peter, and I'm ready to rumble. Good run down the left. What can they make of it? Blaszczykowski knocks it towards the front. Mascherano comes sliding in. Loose. Blaszczykowski. Oh, he did the hard part right, but fluffed the finish. I think there's always that danger that the defence can get exploited in that way. That must have served as a real wake-up call to them. Well, that should set them on their way and get into a nice rhythm. The early signs are very encouraging now. did so well with that interception, but what followed was a pretty lethal counter-attack that took seconds to convert. That's as sharp as it gets, believe me. Well, that has certainly made things interesting. Rakitic. He wasn't very far from making something happen by himself. Lovely to see. Fiorentina have hit the front early, a foothold in the game. What a good start to the game. I think their play has been fast and inventive, and, and this is a fine example of early intent. They've begun as they mean to go on, and another goal is on the cards. Tries a through ball. Mascherano pushes it out wide, and it's Pasquale. was physical, no nonsense, and it had to be. Luis Suarez, chipped through. Here it comes. Messi. Suarez has a goal! That's a half-decent try. And there is a perfect illustration as to what can happen when an attack breaks down. Yeah, they may have escaped punishment on that occasion, but they'll need to wise up to avoid being caught cold again. Their vulnerability has been exposed now, so let's see if they can react to it. Rakitic passes it through. It's got through to him. Away from immediate danger. He scored inside the first ten minutes to make it 1-0. Valero floats one over. Now it's Teo. Christian Teo. Unable to make it happen for all his good intentions. Daniel Alves. Rakitic tries to get it forward quickly. Luis Suarez plays it out to the flank. Matias Fernandez. It's the route one option. It's a decent ball. Oh, he would surely have scored there more times than not. Mascherano. 30 minutes gone. Rakitic. Daniel Alves. Iniesta. Another piece of really good defending. Great ball. Now the shot. And. He's straight offside. Fine defending there. So that was an exemplary tackle. Stopped him dead in his tracks. Messi. He saw that coming. Complaints about that challenge. Robust but fair. That had to be more accurate. Fiorentina leading by one and looking very comfortable on it. Doesn't get the pass he's looking for. Looks 
looks like a good ball through. Valero. And it's Teo. Now the pass. Well read, he's sorted that out. Neymar pushes to get on the end of it. Well positioned to make that interception. The story. Valero plays it out to the wing. Looks to slip it through. Messi, chance! Turns and goes back. Matias Fernandez. Neymar. Mascherano cuts it out. And the whistle goes for half time. I'm sure they'll be very happy with the first half performance and the scoreline. They'll definitely want to maintain their momentum now and finish the job. Fiorentina, the happier of the teams, heading in for half time, 1 0 up. And that's the start of another 45 minutes. Fiorentina carry a one goal lead into the second half. Is Fernandez Pasquale spoon forward Rakitic desperately wants to get on the end of this Luis Suarez he's away Luis Suarez there is the genius of Luis Suarez Barcelona are back in business None of us were exactly sure how that was going to end up then, but I'm delighted to see such a happy ending after such a splendid dribbling run. I mean, he really did fool that defence into wondering what he was going to do next. Barcelona grabbed the equaliser, and we're all square. Yeah, in a game like this, every chance is vital, but they're back on level terms. Blaszczykowski goes long. Looks to slip it through. Christian Teo, they score! And that has only enhanced his already huge reputation. They are obviously hoping for an early second half boost, but there are a few who can truly make it happen, and this is a very welcome tonic now. Oh, that was a cracking little exchange to set up the finish, and a lovely understanding between both players. I mean, that's clearly tailored on the training ground and delivered beautifully on match day. Fiorentina get themselves into the lead. Jordi Alba. Iniesta. Jordi Alba. And it's Neymar. Neymar does not like coming off second best. Just about up to the hour now. Fiorentina haven't made a substitution yet. Promising cross. direction he needed yeah, and it all came from very good trickery in the, in the wider position but quite a static defense was pretty fortunate to survive that little episode it should have been much worse and he's made sure that that won't get through Sergio Busquets. Matias Fernandez passes it through. Mashakovsky goes to the cross. Really didn't have enough to concern the defence. Matias Fernandez. Blashakovsky. Matias Fernandez. Blashakovsky. So what now? Played into the middle. Really well taken goal. And with that goal comes comfort. Well, the cross was inch perfect and the header unerring. Well, as contact goes, that was tremendous and it helped him to direct it exactly where he wanted into that net. I think when it comes to the aerial department, this fella is definitely no slouch. His second of the game and an eye now for the hat trick. Fiorentina, and two up and into a position of real strength. 
Well, they've opened a nice gap at this stage, but there's nothing to stop them from trying to widen it a little further. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. This needed to be better than that, and he knows it. Now, surely! have a lovely understanding and they executed the one two impeccably to set up the goal he snaffles his third and that earns him the match ball this is one of the best performances i've seen in a while he's practically taken on this team single-handedly and they don't know how to stop him fiorentina grab a three goal lead it's just too easy rakitic positions himself well and cuts it out move that good inroads into enemy territory but no joy and this is gone presumably for offside that was very very close he was just offside Christian Teo pumps it upfield too much on it and that's the keepers Jordi Alba Iniesta. Good idea, just poorly executed. And very well to intervene. Pascal. Uh, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Yeah, it looked like there that he was asking just a little too much of himself to try and thread that ball through. It was, uh, it was a bit over-ambitious, but I like his thinking. Matthias Fernandes. Now the pass. Oh, good interception. Iniesta. The official showing that there will be three minutes of added time. Iniesta has been caught there, it's a foul. And he's going to have his name taken. Looks like he's picked up a bit of a knock from that challenge. Now it's Luis Suarez. Now it's Neymar. the final whistle. Fiorentina, winners of a no contest, they just swamped their opponents in superior quality.